Now, if you're looking to lose a couple of those pesky pounds, or a lot of pounds, actually, before you hit the beach this summer, we have the solution for you. Eric Berg is here with the answer. His new book is The Seven Principles of Fat Burning. Eric, welcome here. Now, before we started uh, in the break, you were talking to us about losing weight in your sleep. I've got to <laughs> hear about this. How does this work, and is it true? Well, you know that 99% uh, of all the fat burning is occurring when you're sleeping, not, none during the day. In fact, if you weigh yourself when you wake up in the morning before you, before, uh, and you compare that to before you go to sleep, it would be like zero. But if you have a good night's sleep, you weigh a lot less. So if you're doing all your fat burning at, at sleepy time, the more you sleep, the more you lose. Exactly. Exercise doesn't burn fat. It triggers hormones mm -hmm. that do the burning 24 to 48 hours later when you're sleeping. Is that right? Yeah. Now, you also say that in order to lose weight, you need to know your body type. And you break it down into four different body types. One is adrenal. One is liver ovary and thyroid and the way you know which body type you are well we've broken it down for you there adrenal has a sort of saggy stomach liver a protruding stomach ovary if you have those saddlebags that women have and then thyroid is weight all over and basically you have a different prescription for each one yeah and and basically would you eat differently would you exercise differently depending on your body type you do everything everything is different exercising for example the sagging belly here let's put that graphic type. up yeah. again and go through them uh, one by one starting yeah. with the adrenal if you're the adrenal body type what do you do but what you do exercise is not good because th that body type is already exercising 24 hours a day they're stressed mm -hmm. out they can't sleep they go up the stairs they can't get out of, they're out of breath easily they crave salty foods right um, the liver body type it's the protruding. Right. They have their. Uh, they have right shoulder pain. They have issues with craving for what fat. What causes foods. that protruding, and what can you do about it? Well, a lot of things cause it. Uh, not just alcohol, but you see usually see the uh, protruding effect. That's usually liver leaking right. fluid into the stomach. And those people you say should eat high quality protein, lots of veggies. The one for the adrenal, they should sleep more than they should exercise. I'm going to try that. <laughs> yeah. Real quick, quickly, for people who have the ovary type uh, body, what should they be doing? They should avoid soy. Soy is estrogenic. Uh, more soy. Uh, estrogen causes fat, uh -huh. especially cellulite on the hips. Sure. And, and thyroid. thyroid. Thyroid should be careful about chemicals because the thyroid is very sensitive against environmental estrogens and things in the food supply. Very it interesting. Be real clean. If people wow. would like more information, you've got a website. It's bergdiets.com. The book is The Seven Principles of Fat Burning. Eric Berg, we thank you very much. Thank you. Interesting Thanks, concept. Fascinating stuff. Thank you.